Yeah. Well, you know. <laughs> she captured Billy Crystal's heart and the hearts of audiences all over the world and when Harry met Sally. In Sleepless in Seattle, it was Tom Hanks who fell under her spell. But in her latest film, When a Man Loves a Woman, Meg Ryan tests Andy Garcia's love with the harsh realities of an alcoholic struggling to hold her family together. I mean, I am not your problem. I am not your problem to solve! It was so much more fun in the old days, wasn't it, Michael? It's not just about alcoholism. Like, I, I really felt like I didn't have to go far for to find the parts of her that were... That she was disappointed in herself or that she didn't think highly or she didn't expect much of herself or that she slowly had to become more and more honest with who she is. My bottom was 184 days ago when my, uh, my little girl watched me wash down aspirin with vodka and then I hit her. Every day I, it was like taking off a coat. You know, and then you go off and you take another one. And I, and I felt, like, lighter in the end, oddly enough. You know, it required a kind of emotional stamina. It's also a rare opportunity for Ryan to break from her sweet girl-next-door image, but still deliver a movie that die-hard romantics will enjoy. She has 600 different kinds of smiles. They can light up your life. They can make you laugh out loud, just like that. They can even make you cry, just like that. It's really a story about sort of renegotiating the terms of a, of a relationship and, and what happens when the dynamics of your marriage or your relationship change. How do, how do, you, how do you keep it together? How do you keep your family together when every, everything is so changeable? Lisa Petrillo, Channel 10 Eyewitness News, Daybreak.